Hey guys, today what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at this little fella. This, this little infrared temperature sensor. Basically, you hold it at a distance and it senses the temperature of whatever's in front of it. I got this schematic. It works at 4.5 volts or thereabouts. We're going to connect it using this up to this little fellow which is an Arduino Mini. So that's the plan. Well I figure what I'll do is we'll get it working with the regular Arduino on this board here. And a little sensor over there. And that way it'll be a lot easier for me to attach this and get it going. I can just plug the USB in here. So I'll solder along the top there, shove it in here, and I'll have a screen to operate this and this so I won't have to view it over serial. And then the idea is to swap this out for the Mini and package it up. That'll be a lot easier to get it working first. Alrighty, so we've got it together, and this is exciting. Take a look. Alright, so let's power her up. Load up the example code from the Freetronics website. It's up over here, this is him. Upload. Should be running. Open the serial. Bam, there you go. What I'll do is I'll put my hand in front of it and we'll see what happens. Here it goes. Hand. Whoa, 26 degrees. That's cool. A hot soldering iron. There it is. So there you have it. It's all working. Now all we're gonna do is figure out how to add this fellow. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, check it out. Uh, I had a bit of a problem when I connected pins 15 and 16 on the on the right here because this is standard it's a it's a 14 pin uh, connection you can look it up on Wikipedia 14 pin LCD it tells you how to wire it up and 15 and 16 I had it the wrong way around plus and minus 15 and 16 power the LED by the way so if you put power the wrong way around on an LED it doesn't work anyway all fixed now so let's plug her in have a look We have power, all right? So it says failed to begin with. It's working. What do you know? So if I was to put my hand here, 20 degrees. My hand's a little bit cold. It's warmer over here. 26 degrees. No, the tips of my fingers are pretty cold. Probably because I've been handling this ice cube. Ooh, negative one degrees. There you go. Anyway, as you can see, that is an infrared temperature sensor. Once I've got it all packaged up, 
I'll show you what it looks like. 